Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, I invite you to like, subscribe, and click that notification bell so that you'll be notified each and every time I place a video on this channel. To see this week's sticker book flip through, stay tuned. So this video, I am doing a flip through of the Travel Happy Planner. It has 1,281 pieces here. That is a lot of pieces, y'all, for traveling. I'm just going to do some heavy-duty traveling. And um, I just want to tell you guys, I actually started using this. My son went on a trip um, to Atlanta, and I was so destined to um, do a half sheet with his travel itinerary and travel log. And I will show you, but I put too much personal information on it because it was just for him. But maybe I'll make up another one, and then I'll post it on Instagram um, so make sure that you're following me over on Instagram at Zarius Creations. And if you will note on the front of the planner, there are some examples of how you can use this. So for my newbie planners, you won't be so, so lost. Just take a look at the front or you can take a look at the back so that you can get some ideas. Oh, and while I'm back here, let's take this off. So I did not come up with this myself, but this was a genius idea. So for those of you who don't um, know about this, if, when you're going through these planners, like back and forth, back and forth, opening, closing, pulling, sometimes the pages can get loose. And so what I've learned from my experience planner, babes or planner sisters, is that you just take that clip right off the back, slip it through this hole, you tie it, and then that helps, I'll put it in two knots. You can put it in more if you like. That helps to keep, I need to learn how to tie a knot. <laughs> it helps to keep the pages together. So as you're opening and closing, opening and closing, your pages will still stay intact as long as you got your knot nice and tight. All right, so let's get into the sticker book, the travel sticker book. And from the beginning, we can see it's very colorful. Starts with explore, being an explorer of the world. Let's go somewhere. He has some colorful compasses. Let me make sure I'm not skipping. I am. And then it says, let's wander. Town, city, sun, surf, food, culture. Oh, they're different. Really loving, scenic views, relaxing vibes. So all these say, let's wander into where maybe this is so that you can start generating a bucket list so you can actually um, start traveling and going to visit and then when you actually get there you can put what scenic views you like relaxing vibes and adventures then they have some travel stickers adventures call where are you going via air rail land or sea where to go next time for an adventure Let's be adventurous. You can write your notes here. Explore the unseen. This would be great for my trip to LA. I think I'm going to bug my cousins because I'm going to keep pulling out my Happy Plans book and they're going to see all these stickers because I'm a, I'm a planner of planner, y'all. For my 40th birthday, I went to Atlanta for the first time and I literally planned every minute i was wearing my cousin my best friend and one of my high school girlfriends i was wearing them out to the point where we could not go to the national aquarium because they were like look we need a nap as young as we are and i was the oldest one so i actually am going to love these i think i'm going to utilize these a whole lot and create my own happy plans and these are nice reminders to remind you to send a postcard back home or mail, especially if you're going away for a long time. So many adventures, living the dream, or you can circle, just relaxing, being adventurous, sightseeing, date, place, details. Whew, um, I can't wait to use these. Adventures call. Oh, I love this. That's so cute. Road trip, wander. Wanderlust or wanderlust. Which one is it? I should know this. Wanderlust, yes. I just had a little brain freeze right there. Vacation, away we go. To travel is to live. 
these are some great stickers y'all y'all definitely you want to travel y'all definitely even if you do a staycation y'all you're going to want to get this sticker book right here where what who if you want to just explore your city um these would be good for that too just get yourself a happy plans and um get to planning your itinerary Oh, and then you can go through how's the weather. Oh, I definitely need these because I actually just made up some. So now what I made up, I'm going <laughs> to throw away and start over because you could do how's the weather for each of the days. I'm going to need another one of these. Your packing list, what you need to pack for your trip. Make it a couple of those. Packing list, packing list. Then you have some nice squares to write in the boat. What hotel you're staying in. You check in the days you check in, the days you check out, and this looks like a countdown. Only it gives you. I'm confused. I guess it only gives you. Oh, so you have some days here, so you have up to six days on your countdown. Then you have like one week, two weeks, a month, two months, three months. So you have like a little countdown. And these are cute. Away we go. You can mark when you're coming home. If it's just a weekend trip. Ooh, you got your beach vibes here. Your passport. You got your fun stickers here for your trips. You can the Eiffel Tower. Your payphone. Statue of Liberty. Give me good company and the open road ever chasing a sign then you just have your worded stickers so you can mark down if you're touring road trip that's a piece of hair travel log let's go estimate time of arrival you're to and from your hello your goodbye so fun love this moment but what if you didn't have a good time do they have a sticker for that Then you have your weather again, and I actually use one for my son's list. I forgot. I actually totally forgot. You can journal how your um, trip went. Are you going by air, by car, by train, by boat? Or what is this, a mobile home? I guess that's like symbolic for the winter bagel, like if you run a winter bagel. Then you have letters so you can actually write out some words. Then you have your dates and your days of the week that pops into color. Then you have your colorful words. Now, earlier we had them over in all black handwriting, but you have them in your boxes here. Then you have your flight info, and I use that for my son. Off to, I wish I could show you guys. Um, I should have took a picture beforehand, but I didn't. I was actually so excited. But I'll create another one and then I will post it because I, um, wait, let me see. I could probably use stickies over that important info. Sorry, nope. Too much personal information that would be a whole lot of cover and i just might as well make a whole new one so sorry guys so this one says flight info this is departure info and i use flight for both of them then you have some little arrows and pins there's those squiggly lines that i learned to do then you have a map of the continents, and I love how it showed you on the front of the cover how they actually took a map and they split it between the two pages. I thought that was creative. Oh, and this is probably the one, because those are kind of small. So you have the map here, and they just probably cut right down the middle and put it on two pages. And then, I would probably, I think I know what I'm going to do with this. I'm actually going to mark the states that um, I actually go visit. Or maybe the states that I'm actually going through on my way. I have a trip to California this year. 
and hopefully I'll hit Virginia, I'll hit Florida, I'll hit Baltimore, of course New York, and I'm hopefully Atlanta. I'm not sure if I'm going to make Atlanta this year or not. And then there's some planner conferences that I am actually researching because I would like to attend a planner conference this year. It'll be my first one. Oh, and that's the end of it already. I'm definitely going to need another one of these um, travel sticker books. So, guys, if you haven't seen my other videos, I have put links in this video up above. Out of all the new ones, all of the new planners that came out, Boss Babe is my first choice. And then I think this travel one. It's going to be my second choice. Maybe because I'm so excited about traveling and I have a trip planned. Um, well, that's all I got for you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to click that like and subscribe button and the notification bell so that you'll be the first to know when a new video is posted to this channel. Until next time.